Hi, I'm Mark Ryan. Earlier this year, I published videos on how to deploy fast AI models. You can see the description of this video for links to those videos. Now, since I published those videos on fast AI model deployment, I've received some questions about how exactly to save models after they've been trained and how to load the saved models so that they can be deployed. In this video, I'll go over how to save trained fast AI deep learning models and how to load saved models. The examples in this video are also featured in my upcoming book from Pact Publishing, Deep Learning with Fast AI Cookbook. There are two fast AI functions you need to know about to save and load trained models. First, you use the export function to save the trained model. Next, you use the load learner function to load the saved model. You can use this function to load saved models in notebooks for quick validation of a model, as well as standalone model deployments. You'll find the files we'll be looking at in the repo for this book. First, we'll look at two notebooks in the CH3 directory of the repo. The saving models trained with tabular datasets notebook, and then the loading saved models trained with tabular datasets notebook. Now, let's look at the models in more detail. Here's a notebook where we have trained a model, and now we're ready to save the model to the file system. First, we'll set the path of the model to a writable directory. For Colab, we set the fully qualified path explicitly so that it corresponds to the same directory and drive as the notebook. For Gradient, we can just set the path to the current directory. Once we've set the path for the model, we can use the export function with the file name we want to use for the saved model as an argument. We're running this experiment in Colab. So if we look at the directory and drive where the notebook is, we see that the pickle file for the model has been saved there, as expected. We've saved the trained model, so now we're going to load it, first in a notebook so we can do a one-off exercise of the model with a single data point. Next, we'll load the model in the context of a web deployment. For the one-off exercise, we set the path for the model the same way we did when we saved the model. Then, we use the load learner function with the name of the pickle file where we saved the model with the export function as an argument. Once we've done this, we can try the loaded model out on some test data to confirm we get the expected results. For a web deployment, the model is loaded in the Flask server module. We've copied the pickle file for the saved model into the same directory as the Flask server module. We use the load learner function, again with the name of the pickle file for the saved model as an argument, and we're ready to go. See links in the description to see a video of this deployment in action. And that's a quick summary of how, to, of how to save trained models in fast AI and then load the saved models to use them either in another notebook or in a deployment, as featured in my upcoming book from Pact Publishing, Deep Learning with Fast AI Cookbook. I hope you enjoyed the video, and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.